To load the unmotion dispenser, begin by opening the cover with the key. Place the new roll in the top bracket. Make sure that the paper feeds over the top of the roll. Pull the paper toward you and overlap the front support bar. Then lift the transfer bar and tuck the paper behind it. Fold and crease a one inch flap at the end of the paper by folding it up. The transfer bar teeth should rest in the crease. With the transfer bar in place, press the advance button on the lower right of the machine. Once the paper feeds through the bottom, tear off the sheet and discard it. And finally, close the cover. To load a replacement roll in the end motion dispenser, first check the size of the existing roll. The existing roll should be the same size as the width of the support, four inches or less. Pull the carousel lock bar toward you and rotate the carousel down 180 degrees until it locks. The partial roll should now be on the bottom. Be sure to rewind any excess back onto the roll. Then follow the same steps as loading a new roll in the dispenser. Begin by placing the new roll in the top bracket. Make sure that the paper feeds over the top of the roll. Then pull the paper toward you and overlap the front support bar. Lift the transfer bar and tuck the paper behind it. Fold and crease a one inch flap at the end of the paper by folding it up. The transfer bar teeth should rest in the crease. Then finally close the cabinet and you're loaded.